And at this point, the communication we're getting with Dragon is actually being routed through the boat itself at this point. So there we can see the lift. Dragon is out of the water. Yeah, so then now that now... A-frame is going to start swinging it back. And it's bound right for that nest at the bottom of your screen. There we're getting a better shot of all the points in which Dragon is tethered to the hydraulic lift, ensuring that it isn't swinging freely. And there we can see Dragon Endeavor being carefully set down. And we see the hatch is now open. Hatch being opened at 12.59, 11.48 p.m. or a.m. Pacific time. Again, the recovery team. SpaceX Dragon from the commander. Go for SpaceX. Here we have our first view of yeah, Doug Mike, Hurley. I just would like to sort of reiterate what Bob said and add uh, my thanks to uh, everybody over the last several years that's either worked in Hawthorne, McGregor, or down at uh, Kennedy Space Center. Anybody who's touched Endeavor, uh, you should take a moment to just cherish this day, especially given all the things that have happened this year. Uh, we certainly can't thank you enough. Our families can't thank you enough. And, uh, just proud to be uh, a small part of this whole effort to get uh, a company, people to and from the space station. They can celebrate with each other. We see you soon. And uh, we'll talk to you soon, hopefully in person. Thanks so much, Doug, and you're welcome. And, and thank you so much for those kind words. And we all wish you a safe journey home and a happy reunion with your family soon. And we look forward to seeing you in person as well. Some really nice words there from Bob Benkin. Mikey. There on your screen, we saw uh, NASA astronaut Doug Hurley egressing or exiting from the capsule. Might have been hard to see on your screen there, but um, we got a thumbs up indicating that uh, things are going well. I'm sorry, excuse me, I mixed up my positions there. Yeah, <laughs> uh, those words were from Doug, and we have Bob that just came out first. Yeah, so Bob Bank and uh, the pilot, the Joint Operations Commander for this mission, out of the capsule now. And so he's making his way over to the medical area, and now they're going to work to get Doug Hurley out next. And I think I saw a smile back. on Bob's face. <laughs> he was he was a thumbs up all the way, as they've been giving us some regular status updates from inside the capsule. They've been feeling really good. And so now we're just standing by for our spacecraft commander, Doug Hurley, to make his way out into the fresh air for the first time in 64 days.
All right, so they're getting set up and we should see spacecraft commander Doug Hurley making his way out of the capsule. And it looks like we've got him out. We've got him seated. And there we go, another thumbs up. We've got some applause here. And as you can see in Mission Control, a standing <laughs> ovation for a job well done all around. Yeah, our, our crew members, Bob and Doug, are now safely back home on Earth. And uh, they're going to get checked out now by the NASA medical team. They're going straight into the medical quarters on board the ship. That'll be their first stop on planet Earth.